Hello, everybody. The film uh, Bambi uh, came out in 1942. It's a cartoon, as you probably know, about a, a fawn who is uh, chosen to be the king of the forest, like his father. And it's a story about love and about friendship uh, and about protecting your dear ones um, against a threat. And in this case, the threat is from human beings. And Walt Disney made this film. It was, um, one critic said it was uh, his crowning achievement. Uh, and the American Film Institute made it the uh, third uh, best uh, animated film uh, ever produced. Dated now, of course, but still a very sweet, sentimental, um, feel-good kind of story. It was based um, on a book produced much earlier in 1923 by Felix Sultan, uh, an Austrian writer, uh, who wrote uh, the, the basis of this story um, as a warning against the rise of fascism. Uh, for him, uh, a bit like Animal Farm, uh, it was a story using animals but to um, create a picture of a world where a one group was going to become um, dominant and oppressive of everybody else uh, in the story. It's human beings over animals. In the real world in Austria it was the growing threat of fascism and eventually uh, the, uh, the emergence of the Nazis. Indeed, the Nazis saw very clearly what this book was about because in 1935 they banned it. But the American public were treated instead to this sanitised, saccharine version of the story, uh, which no one could have seen, really, <laughs> as a warning against fascism. Today is Holocaust Memorial Day, a day when we remember the terrible depths to which fascism can bring us as a human race. And we remember with, with sadness those millions of Jews who died in the concentration camps um, and many others too, other kinds of minority um, who perished uh, under uh, a fascist rule. And I thought that the story about the way the Bambi uh, uh, book had been um, sanitised is a, is a reminder to us that we need to keep our eyes and ears open for those who are spotting signs of emerging fascism and warning us about it. We need to be on our guard against this terrible philosophy that is so destructive, that criminalises minorities, dehumanises people, uh, and can cause enormous suffering. And it's there under the surface. It's part of um, uh, the human psyche, it seems, that this uh, emerges from time to time uh, as a dominant philosophy in society. And we need to make sure it does not in our lifetime by opposing anything that looks remotely like it. Uh, uh, particularly since um, it, it, the, um, the rise of fascism can be cloaked uh, in, in people who pretend they're doing good. And just as Bambi, a story that is, was uh, sweet and feel good, was in originally a warning against fascism. So I think sometimes we can see uh, things uh, going on in society which appear to be quite harmless, but actually under the surface are extremely dangerous. We need to listen to those who are wise enough to point these things out to us and play our part in opposing their development.